happy to be live with you again and I want to thank you all so much for all the responses I got to the request for what it is that you most want to learn. So I've got a lot of videos coming up. This is just one in a series, but I got a lot of requests to learn more about diffusers and diffusing essential oils. So I'm going to start there because I believe that diffusing essential oils actually solves a lot of different other requests that came along as well, but we'll talk more about those too. But when you diffuse essential oils into your home environment, you're actually getting the live molecules of those essential oils into the air. So it works on a lot of different levels. First of all, it's affecting the emotional and behavioral centers of the brain. So you're actually getting uh, uplifting or calming, depending on the oils that you put in your diffuser. But more importantly, I believe, is that you're getting the beneficial properties of the antiviral, antibacterial, immune boosting properties, as well as hormone regulating properties. So you're getting all of those live chemical constituents, you're breathing into your body. So you're actually taking them into your body. So it helps boost the immune system, which many of you have asked about. We're going to talk about that next week when we do an, our next video. But the oils, when you're inhaling them, is actually working on the whole system of your body. So it is boosting your immune system with the immune enhancing properties that a lot of essential oils have. So I want to show you my favorite diffuser. And I've gone through a lot of diffusers over the years. And the reason I like this one so much is, and I'm going to just show you what it looks like here. So this is called a nebulizer, this glass part, and there's the pump. This is an electric pump underneath it. And if you look up close, I'm going to show you, there's two little tubes inside of here. So one of them pulls essential oil up, the center tube, and the curved one on the outside blows air so that as the oil comes up that tube, the other one that's blowing the air actually blows the oil against the side of the nebulizer and it breaks it into really small little parts that are then air, I'm going to say air soluble, that's not really the term, but they're small enough that they actually, they rise up out of the top. There's a little hole in the top of this, if you can see that or not. And the oils actually will rise up out of the top and they'll permeate your room with the aromatic molecules. And the thing I love most about this particular diffuser is it gets a lot of oil into the atmosphere, but it's also really quiet so you don't hear it. I've had a lot of diffusers. I brought some back from France and I've tried a lot of different ones from different companies here and they all make a lot of noise. <laughs> and so I like them running in the background. The only downside to that is, is you have to remember they're running in the background so that you don't go through a lot of oils. This does go through a lot more oils than most, but that's a good thing because it means it's getting a lot of those aromatic molecules into the air. So you've got all the antiviral and antibacterial properties that you're breathing in. And I did a, a study, I've talked about this before, but it, I think it bears repeating where I was with a convalescent care center of elderly with Alzheimer's and dementia who are very frail and have a very weak immune system. And we started diffusing oils in that part of the residential care facility. And nobody that year got sick. None of the caregivers or the residents got sick in that convalescent care center. And it was because they were breathing in all those antiviral, antibacterial properties. So with all the superbugs and super viruses that are happening these days that are antibiotic resistant, we need to have all the antiviral, antibacterial properties of essential oils protecting us from these superbugs and superbacteria. So 
that's my video for today. I hope you all have enjoyed learning a little bit more about diffusing. I'm going to leave a uh, link for the diffuser and where you can get it in the email. So until next week, have an awesome, aromatic, blessed week.